Generally, actions performed before a promise is made aren't valid consideration for that promise. In Booth v. Fitzpatrick, the Vermont Supreme Court considered whether a promise based on a previously received benefit could be legally enforced. In September of 1860, Martin Fitzpatrick's bull escaped and wandered into Bishop Booth's pasture. Booth kept and cared for the bull while he made repeated inquiries to find its owner. In November, Booth contacted Fitzpatrick after learning Fitzpatrick owned the bull. After Booth described the bull, Fitzpatrick agreed it was his and promised to pay Booth for the costs of caring for the bull. Fitzpatrick then came to see the bull at Booth's farm, confirmed it was his, and said he would make arrangements to collect it. He also made a second promise to compensate Booth for the bull's care. In May, Booth contacted Fitzpatrick again to request he retrieve the bull as soon as possible. Fitzpatrick agreed to do so the following day and to leave Booth's payment with his associate. The next day, Fitzpatrick collected his bull, but left no money for Booth. Booth sued Fitzpatrick to recover the promised amount, and the trial court entered a judgment in Booth's favor. Fitzpatrick appealed to the Vermont Supreme Court. He argued that his promise to pay wasn't enforceable, because it was made upon past consideration that Fitzpatrick never requested.